Merci beaucoup. Oh, what a great performance. Thank you very much for this exclusivity. The first TV, I suppose, in France. Yes. And uh, very, very nice. I like your voice. I like your songs. <laughs> and in studio, we have some uh, musicians from, and her mom is there too. But please, a great applause for Caroline Spence. <laughs> Thank you. It's a long way from uh, Nashville to France. Your first time to come to France? I spent about 14 hours in Paris, but I know Paris isn't all of France, so I'm excited to see the whole country. Yeah. And uh, your first tour and uh, mm -hmm. some dates around here in east of France. You're going to play Paris soon and mm -hmm. south of France. Yes. Yes, that's great. And. Uh, When did you decide to to play songs and to write to play songs and uh, when did you learn the guitar? Well, um, even as a child, I used to write songs for fun. It, I just always loved music. Um, my grandfather, this is my grandfather's bolo tie and his guitar strap, and he taught me how to play guitar, a few chords, when I was about 12. And then I started kind of trying to write really good songs uh, when I was about 15, 14, and moved to Nashville when I was 21 to try and do it for a living. Mm -hmm. And uh, can you tell us uh, who, was, who were your first influences? First influences? Well, when I was a child, uh, we listened to a lot of The Beatles <laughs> and uh, a woman named Mary Chapin Carpenter uh, who's also from Virginia and when I kind of found my own music um, I really like Ryan Adams and I really like Tom Petty and uh, Patty Griffin and um, yeah you like the songwriters I do like <laughs> the songwriters yeah it means uh, tonight uh, this afternoon it was not tonight you have uh, played a majority of your own uh, songs yes mm -hmm. and uh, you had released two albums yes. the first one I suppose is that one yes the one somehow yeah that's my first album that's your first mm -hmm. album and uh, how long did you release it uh, in 2015 20 so three yeah. years ago yeah. ah, it's not so yeah. <laughs> And for this first album, you use your own song too, or you yeah. have uh, some uh, friends to help you to um, compose? I have maybe one song I wrote with a friend on that one, but um, other I wrote all by myself. Mm -hmm. And today you have performed some of this album? Yeah, a few. But mm -hmm. uh, for the people uh, looking at us, uh, next week we had a special radio with these two albums and mm -hmm. they will discover all your songs. Yay, <laughs> thank you, thank you. But um, now uh, we are going to talk about uh, the new album, the new album uh, out last year? Yes, suppose? last year. Mm -hmm. And uh, Spades and Roses, mm -hmm. why did you choose this title? Um, it's from a, a lyric Um, in one of the songs, and um, the line is, you cannot call a spade a rose, and so it's kind of about um, telling the truth and being honest about um, yourself and things in your life, and that's why I called it that. I suppose you you write, you wrote some majority of the songs, mm -hmm. no? no? Yeah. And uh, this one was... Uh, uh, one of uh, in the charts in USA in in Nashville I suppose yeah, mm -hmm. I suppose, yeah we recorded I suppose, in Nashville yeah, yeah. and uh, for 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 this album uh, it's it w it's uh, the album you are going to promote in this tour mm -hmm. and uh, you are alone but for this album I suppose you are oh, yeah, musician full band yes yes uh, full production there's even some strings on on things it's a On the road, sometimes you are alone, but sometimes you are with musician, I suppose. Too. Yes, it depends on. It's a little hard to get an entire band over to France, so I figured I'd go first. Maybe next time I bring 
bring a friend or two. <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah. And uh, this album, uh, uh, I it's a new one. It's mm -hmm. a new one. It's going to be performed for the t in the tour. Mm -hmm. But in this tour, uh, you are going to use some covers, no? I'm what, sorry? Some covers. Yes. I do like to do a few covers, especially, you know, it's it's been fun to... Um, I just toured in the UK and to see some songs are universal, everyone knows. Um, and so I like to play a couple just to kind of bring people together so we can all have a song we know. And uh, it's not the first time you come to Europe? Uh, well, y yes, I did a small tour in Switzerland a few years ago, um, but it's my first kind of proper um, long tour over here. Mm -hmm. We are expecting that uh, a lot of people are, are looking at us <laughs> and uh, we have sent 5,000 letters all around the world for these concerts live on Nancy Web TV and we are expecting a lot of tour promoters are interesting to uh, bring you back to uh, oh, yes. somewhere <laughs> in Europe or as well. I'd be happy to come back, <laughs> happy to come back. And um, about uh, this tour, I'm going to uh, uh, give the dates to the public because tonight she's going to play uh, very, very close to the TV. It's about 10 minutes. She's going to play uh, the nice tone of Nancy. Mm -hmm. I suppose you've never been to Nancy. I have not. But uh, Philippe, we make you discovering this beautiful town. What a, what a very, very nice town. I need my glasses because... Uh, um, tonight, don't, uh, she's going to play Clou et le Bec. Je vais le dire en français puisqu'on est en France. Hein. Ce soir, elle va jouer au Clou et au Bec, c'est Place des Vosges à Nancy. Vous connaissez cet endroit. Demain, elle va aller à Paris. Elle va jouer à Ma Pomme en Colimaçon. Mercredi, elle va dans le sud de la France. You're going to the sun à Gap pour le cabaret pop. Jeudi à saint andré de vals c'est toujours dans le sud de la France, la salle des fêtes. Vendredi, Montbrun-les-Bains. Euh, samedi, Ferrassière. Et puis dimanche, euh, elle va terminer, elle va revenir euh, dans la région. Elle va revenir euh, dans, les, dans les Vosges, Small Mountain, les Vosges. Mm -hmm. uh, for a nice place called Le Grattoir. We know this place because we used to promote this place. And uh, it's a large tour. It's a uh, one week. Uh, it's nice. Yeah, I'm excited <laughs> to see your country. <laughs> and uh, on your album, uh, le, the last album, I've used some, uh, some songs for promoting tonight concert. Sometimes you use electric guitar, mm -hmm. and for this tour, you only play uh, acoustic guitar. Yes. Um, you need well, wha what is the reason? Yeah. It's a reason. Well, of it's a, a it's a reason of travel because yeah. you need an amp, and the amp is. I don't want to carry that <laughs> through the airport. No, thank you. Uh, yeah, so it's just a simpler way to travel. Um, yeah. Okay, I think uh, we are going uh, to finish the show for today. And uh, see you tonight yes, at Le Clou. Yes, excited. And um, je vais remercier ben, Pierrot qui était à l'image, Claude qui était donc euh, à la lumière et webmaster. Euh, bien sûr, Alain qui était au son. Alors euh, la semaine prochaine, euh, bien sûr, euh, ce show euh, va être sur le web, will be on the web, and everybody. Uh, uh, will be invited to podcast uh, as he would uh, this mm -hmm. show. And uh, the le prochain concert, il aura donc lieu uh, vendredi prochain, et ce concert, ce sera du jazz avec un, un grand amateur de jazz qui nous vient de, de Luxembourg, mais qui est au conservatoire de Bruxelles en Belgique, c'est Arthur Possing. Donc une bonne après-midi. Un grand merci à Caroline encore une fois. On peut encore l'applaudir parce que c'était vraiment un, un super show. Je pense que ce soir, euh, je vais être le plus heureux du monde pour revoir ce, ce nouveau spectacle que tu vas faire qui sera différent. Donc, euh, merci beaucoup. Et rendez-vous donc euh, pour Arthur Possing très bientôt. Bonsoir à toutes et à tous.
beat goes on The beat goes on goes on 